Cornish Pirates Director of Rugby Ian Davis took on the head coach role in 2012 and after two consecutive sixth place championship finishes, the Pirates are currently lying in the same spot. We are here in Penzance to find out what he makes of this year's campaign and whether they can challenge for a top four finish. Ian, you're currently lying in the middle of the table. How would you sum up the Pirates' season so far? Probably doing better than we expected, to be honest. Uh, really young squad, a uh, few older players, very old. Um, so we thought we'd be fighting relegation, if we're being perfectly honest with you. But the boys have come together really well. Some of the younger players have, have certainly stood up due to injury, maybe with the, the older players. They've, they've been taking their chance. Um, most of the guys are staying on for next year, which is fantastic. We've said it's a two-year programme, so the fact that they're staying on means that we can develop further again. Um, bit inconsistent, some really good wins and then some awful defeats. Um, so we're doing better than we are and pushing for fourth place, hopefully. You've obviously finished in sixth place twice in the last two championships. How realistic a goal is a top four finish? Um, at the start of the season, it wasn't at all, but I think everybody has been so inconsistent, apart from Bristol and, and Worcester, um, you're in the mixing pot and uh, I think we're fighting relegation and fighting for the top four all in the same season, which is quite unusual really. The Cornish Pirates are obviously the only team to have defeated Bristol this season. Do you feel that on your day you could beat any team in the Championship? Yeah, I think that's the same for every team, but we just caught them cold maybe one day and, and we played particularly well. Um, but then we followed up with two defeats with sides who are ninth and 10th in the table. So I think this year, more than any other year, it's, you've got to be on song, otherwise you get beaten. Simple as that. And this year we're trying to be a little bit more positive in how we play, um, a little bit more 15-man um, rather than forward-oriented where we've been previously um, because the, the nature of the squad has changed um, and probably the balance of the team has changed slightly. Um, so we try and move the ball around a little bit. Um, high risk, high reward. You're playing Rotherham on Sunday. What are you expecting from them? Very much the same. You know, they're the northern equivalent of us, really. Uh, get their players stolen by the Premiership, have to rebuild all the time, small budget, play an attacking brand. Um, good coach in Lee Blackett. Hopefully he thinks the same the other way. Um, top, top guy, got a lot of time for Lee. Um, and you know you're going to have a cracking game of rugby against them.